Hey guys, it's Rachel. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to the vlog where you and I prep for the tortured poets department. In this vlog, we will be distracting ourselves, we will be decorating, and I am just so freaking excited, you guys. So I thought I'd kick it off right here, right now. It is a week from today that the tortured poets department comes out and Emma will be here in six days and I can't believe that we are now T minus a week away. As I'm starting to film this, when you guys are seeing this, it is the day before. Anyways, okay, so I thought I'd kick it off by uh, opening these four Amazon packages because why not? My mom and I are actually gonna start DIYing tonight and she is very artsy, she's very crafty, so I did solicit her help. Okay, first package, it sounds like beads. Oh, I was correct, it is beads. These are so pretty. Now, I didn't really buy these for the Tortured Poets Department. Um, I'm sure Emma and I will be making bracelets, but it's just like pretty pastel colors. Like, um, there's like a pretty pastel blue and pink and purple. I'm obsessed, um, but yeah, you guys, okay. Oh, and then there are heart balloons in here. There's a 10 count of heart balloons in here. And this is what my mom and I will be DIYing. Now, let me tell you guys something a little hilarious here. So I told Emma earlier, I was like, oh my God, um, I have things coming for the Torture Poets Department. Like I'm gonna decorate. And she was like, oh my God, let me see. And I was like, no, you won't see until you walk through my door. She didn't like that. So. <sighs> We went back and forth. We banter very playfully. We're best friends. It happens. Um, so I was like, fine, I'll show you. And so I showed her, but little does she know that this is this is not the end of the decorations. Like, I'm not just putting up white heart balloons. Like, I'm not just, you guys will see another item here in a second. Um, I'm gonna ramp it up a little bit. Like, I'm gonna tortured poets it up. <laughs> So that's why I'm soliciting my mom's help because she can draw and this girl cannot. This one seems heavy. Okay. Oh. Oh my god. So I did get these for the Torture Poets Department because on my table I want to put like a little, you know, friendship bracelet making little area because I know for a fact Emma and I are going to be trying everything possible to distract ourselves from the time that she gets here to the time it's time for tortured pose to come out so i got these black letters and i thought that they were very tortured poets and then this oh my gosh fancy box for some beads um i just got more of my gold letter beads because i was running out and the beads, the excess of beads are very necessary. Now look, I absolutely love making bracelets and it's honestly my pastime, but in the next upcoming months, they're gonna be needed. Okay, that's all. Then I got these white paper tags. <laughs> these are for the Torture Poets Department and I'm going to put every single song name on here. They're smaller than I thought, um, but I'm gonna put every single song name on here and spread them like on the table and like, yeah, I'm very excited and I even thought like for the black dog draw like a little black dog or um, Maybe an albatross bird. We'll see. We'll see what happens here I might even get my cat to try and help me DIY, but I don't think that's gonna happen Like it would be so cute in theory to put her paw prints on a couple of those like um, Like some stuff that Taylor Nations posted like that would be really cute in theory But I don't think Jasmine's gonna want to participate in this um, okay, and then the last thing I got is actually for my outfit for release day, and I'm really hoping that it works. And I'm really hoping that it works. They're clip-on earrings. I do not have my ears pierced. For $4, these seem really, really cute. They're like four seventy-six, dollars like something. Oh. Oh, these are like gorgeous. Like, are you... Okay, now let's see if, I'm like scared to put it on my ear. Is it gonna slip off? Wait, why is this bigger than my ear? Help. I don't know if these are gonna fly. I feel like it's like, 
Um, I feel like I'm not vibing with that. Well, it was a very nice try. They're very heavy also, like very, very heavy. I mean, they're cute, but they also look not me. Well, those will be returned to Amazon, but you know what? If you never try, you never know. So, that's what I'll say on that. <laughs> you know, you never try, you just you just don't know. So, those will be going back to Amazon, but yeah, you guys, so I will see you guys when my mom and I start DIYing. <laughs> Look at her, she's so cutie. How do you feel? Like, how do you feel about being a um, an intern at the Tortured Poets Department? I love it, but look, <laughs> that sharpie just bit the dust. <laughs> it's not because of the mylar, but look at the artiste. Yes. Um. So I also got these little white hearts that I'm gonna put like on the table and things like that. They also have a hole where you could string it. So that would be cute to string somewhere. I would, you but know, not when, it. No, originally when you talked about putting it there, I, that's what I thought you meant. But I think it would be too small. If these were bigger, that would be cute. But like, oh yeah, you couldn't. I could drape it somewhere. You could. But anyways, I'm gonna write the song names on these and see what we cook up. It might just kind of be like do it and then figure out where it goes, you yeah, know. Yeah. Or you could do them as like a little, you know, like a little table spread. You put them on the refrigerator. You could, uh, we could Easter egg hunt it. And I could have Emma find all of them. Do I have chocolate on my chin? No. Oh, no. Oh, it's a shadow. Committee. You are the entertainment committee. So, um, back to the little banner idea. So I'm gonna tie, I'm gonna write every single song and then I'm gonna tie it and then I put it up here along my bar area. Um, I think it would look really cute. Show me your artwork. Oh. So far, that looks really good. What that, do you think? That looks really good. Yeah. God. Can you say that again? I don't even know what I said. I said a screwdriver for I can fix him. No, I really can. A screwdriver because he screwed her over. So we're drawing um, like little pictures that we're going <laughs> to hang on the, uh, the string. Like the black dog. Wow, that's just not focusing. There we go. Um, like Clara Bow and like things like that. Like two for Fortnite because like that's a two week period. Anyways, the smallest man who ever lived. Tiny man. So that was my mom's idea for uh. And what about the screwdriver? Should I draw one? Yeah. That's what I think. He screwed her over. <laughs> Hi, Jazzy. She wants to string. Oh, oh, baby kitty. She's so cute. Grandma's fun. Grandma's the fun fucker. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> it's me. It's me. Hi. I'm back. Um, it's time to prep some more for Tortured Poets. I am sitting in front of Hobby Lobby because today has been um, very telling and we've gotten more like visual things because of the Spotify pop-up in LA. And so in here, I was originally going in for gold glitter and I was going to dip <laughs> um, my quill pen in gold at the top. However, um, I think I need more now. I need some white lace. Um, I think I'm going to make like a little banner around my bar area and hang that string of um, songs somewhere different because that would look better like vertically anyways um, rather than horizontally. So I am going to full-fledged decorate more. Um, and so there were, there was white lace in the Spotify pop-up which Oh my god, deep breaths are necessary because I, um, oh my god. Um, and then there were dried flowers, and so poppies were in there, there was some lavender on the side, and there were some daisies. So I'm gonna see what I can find. I don't know how much Hobby Lobby has in like the, uh, the dried flower department. I might have to like improvise or quick order on Amazon or something. We will see. But also, uh, I have a gold cage in 
like a little bird cage that sits by my couch. I got it when I moved into my first apartment because Taylor had one in her first apartment. So it was very symbolic to me. But you know what was also in the pop-up shop today? You guessed it, a gold cage, a little gold bird cage and it had dried flowers in it. So the synopsis is I need, I need dried flowers and I need white lace. And um, I think tomorrow I'm going to go get white roses from the grocery store. And I just like, I am so excited. This is the first, like, of course I've like had Taylor's version. Like I had 1989 Taylor's version. That was my first release in my apartment, but I haven't had like a brand new Taylor album in my apartment and Emma's coming. So I just want to make this as like festive as possible. And uh, we're doing that. So all's fair and love and poetry in the words of Taylor Swift. And we got new lyrics today help like guys i am not ready for this like i'm telling you i am not ready for this album i've never been so like anxious for an album in my entire life so with that being said i'm going into hobby lobby and you guys are gonna come with me we're gonna see what we can find oh god i also need to tell you guys this piece of information there was no glitter pen spotted however there was a uh, fountain pen and a quill pen so do with that information what you will i'm not ready to decorate for july 4th yet but look at these oh look how cute oh my god and the little ditch bells okay they have a lot of like feathers and stuff i almost thought about getting these or maybe i should get some of these hmm wish you guys could tell me luxury quills you say i'm gonna back up and i think i'm gonna get some black glitter too because something tells me that's gonna be appropriate. And that is going to be like here. Is that a good one? Yeah. These are very uh, pretty, but I don't think they're gonna apply here, but they might. You know what? They're, they're pretty. But I think I'm gonna wait because I'm sure Emma and I will need to kill some time and we'll wanna come here. I have acquired the white lace. Oh boy. Okay. This, I think, is going to fit the vibe perfectly. Um, the roses are getting absolutely deceased on there, so um, I think I'm going to get two of them to stick out of the birdcage. Oh, I just went down the wedding aisle and I found some things. Um, look at this. I'm going to get this for my cat. Like, leave it to me to get... Like, it's a little... It's really pretty and has a little bell on it. Um, I found a lace table runner. Um... This is gonna eat. Who's ready? I'm not, but I'm preparing. Guys, I just got back in my car. Literally, just got back in my car. I looked down at my phone. Emma's like, they're flipping for a new lyric at 2 p.m. 2 p.m. LA time. It's 5.01 here, Eastern time. So that means like right now. So I guess I'm gonna sit here in the Hobby Lobby parking lot in case I drastically just like need to zoom back in real quick. Oh. Thank you, Taylor. I'm so glad you peered through a window. listening to midnight rain they have umbrellas and stuff out oh one less tempress one less dagger to sharpen ah! i'm really scared for friday you guys oh yes ma'am yes i saw it okay good that's all i had to say i'm scared me too. That's vicious. Yeah. <sighs> oh, I literally sat in the Hobby Lobby parking lot in case I had to run back in. <laughs> now I'm just terrified. Well, I was terrified before. Okay. Oh, God. Right. Bye. Bye. <sighs> it's just chaos o'clock over here. I'm going home to decorate, though. Yeah, Jasmine is at the point of the night where she's going to be meowing a lot. Um, she does this 
about this time because she wants me to sit down. Like if I'm up moving around, like she wants me to sit down and that's why she's meowing at me. It's whenever I look at her. Hi baby. Hmm. I know, but it's Tortured Poets Week. Um, okay. So it is 1020 at night. I showered, well I got home, I filmed a video and then I got Olive Garden for dinner. I treated myself to Olive Garden and then I decided to go ahead and edit the video and schedule it. So that is done. And then I just talked to Emma for a little bit. I talked to Haley for a little bit. And then, um, oh my God, Taylor's releasing a music video on Friday at 8 p.m. So just like, I am so excited. I am so excited. And what the hell does this mean? What, what is up with the twos? I fear we're gonna find out soon. Anyways, so I wanna do a little, couple little things tonight. Um, like, I kinda wanna go ahead and do the quills tonight. So I'm just gonna show you what I got from Hobby Lobby. So I started out with getting um, the Fancy Feathers Turkey Quills. So they look like this and um, there's 10 of them in there. And then I got some lavender sprigs. Now I don't know if I'm gonna end up using these um, because I remember that I do have, I have, so I have this lavender that sits out anyways um, in this cute little jar in my kitchen as decor. So I don't know if, I'm gonna need that lavender. We'll, we'll see, we'll see if I need it. I got it just in case because I didn't wanna have to keep running back and forth. If I don't use it, I can always return it. Um, I got more beads. These beads are gorgeous. Um, they're my favorites right now and they were half off. So I went ahead and grabbed them. And then I got some E6000 glue because that is definitely necessary with these quills. So what I wanna do is I wanna dip the tip of the quill in that gold or that black and like put it in a jar. And I think it would be really cute. Um, actually, I might have to steal that jar. We'll see, we'll just see what happens. Um, and then I got, I actually found this in the wedding section. They had some like cute white lacy stuff and um, it's just this and it dangles and it's white lace and it just looked very like tortured poets and so here jazzy <gasps> she likes it okay well maybe we're not interested she said mom i just want i just want attention anyways do you like it okay well I will never forget about my kitty cat, so there's that. She would rather have something like um, string, which I'm very careful about giving her string because I never want her to like choke or anything, but she'd rather have like my ponytail holder or something like that, like, or a box. Like if I have a box out, that cat will go after it, but it's just so funny, like what cats go after. Um, anyways, these. These I'm definitely going to use because the roses, look dead and looking back i probably should have gotten more but i'm gonna put them in the gold cage that's actually one of my first motives tonight um and i got two of those yeah they just look dead like it's, it's just supposed to yeah um i really don't think i'm gonna use this lavender uh okay we'll just keep the receipt and then i got the gold glitter and then i got the black fine glitter and then I got this white lace now this white lace I want to put along my bar here um, and I think it's gonna look really really cute if it goes correctly the way I'm seeing it in my head and then I also got more string so I got a lot from Hobby Lobby I'm gonna put this bag somewhere um, just in case I don't use everything I will absolutely be returning it um, I am that girl, but I'm very excited. Did I show you guys this? This is a lace table cloth. And I think this is gonna look so pretty. Okay, let's see what she looks like. There was one that was $12.99 and then, the, oh. Oh yeah. 
So there was one that was $12.99 and then there was one that was $3.99 and I often put $3.99. Oh, that's gonna look really pretty. Okay. Well, I wish I hadn't undone it because now I have to like, okay. But anyways, um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put on Austin and Allie and kind of just start decorating. I've been on an Austin and Allie kick. Um, usually it's Good Luck Charlie, but the other night I saw Austin and Allie on Disney Plus and I'm like, you know what? I haven't watched that in a little bit. So our first agenda, birdcage, putting in the dead flowers. And then next is going to be the lace, I think along my bar. Okay, my bar <laughs> has never been used for a bar. My laptop sits there, like help. Um, anyways, you island, whatever you wanna call it. Oh my God, guys, 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 guys. It's so cute, oh my God. Okay, here's what I've got going on with the lavender and I actually think it's pretty cute on my table right here. You can never have too much lavender. So I don't know if I'm gonna keep this here, but it's really cool because my mom and I made this little banner and it has every single song and I hung it, oh, it keeps rotating, um, but I hung it from my light. But um, I'm really proud of this. Like I think that this turned out really freaking adorable. Anyways, so I hung this right here at my table and then I'm gonna end up covering my table um, with that white lace tablecloth, but I'm gonna wait to do that tomorrow. Um, yeah, that'll be like a final touch. But guys, my favorite thing is the gold cage with, with the dead flowers. Like, I'm so sorry, but that is the cutest thing. Thank you so much, Hobby Lobby. Very careful not to make a mess, but um, I'm gonna work on these. I feel so fancy. Um, fun fact, I bought my quill. I have a quill pen down here um, in my little supply basket, and I actually bought it when my mom and I did this tour. It was really cool at this old house. Um, we did like a ghost tour. It was so much fun a couple Halloweens ago, but um, actually, I think it was 2022. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Anyways, it was really fun. Um, I know it was 2022. It wasn't this past year. But anyways, so I'm going to dip. I think I'm going to make a pool of glue on this paper plate and kind of just dip it lightly and then kind of just like dust it. Oh boy. Okay. I just don't want to make a mess. I'm just like not willing to make a mess. When my, <laughs> when my group did all like the bejeweling and stuff for opening night, um, months later I was still finding jewels randomly, like everywhere. Um, I guess I'm just gonna have to be super, super careful. Okay, let's, I'm gonna turn this off so I don't make a disastrous mess. Hello you guys. Uh, I don't know how to say this calmly. Tomorrow night, the Tortured Poets Department comes out. Guys, like, tomorrow this time I will be with Emma. As you guys are watching this, um, it will be, if you guys watch it right when it comes out, it'll be a couple hours, but like if you're watching this at like, uh, like 4.30 Eastern Standard Time, um, I will be with Emma and it will be distraction o'clock. It's already distraction o'clock because I just like, I am going to do everything I can to pass the time. So here's our agenda for tonight. I'm going into the grocery store. I'm back to buy white flowers. Um, I have a really pretty vase I can put them in and, um, I'm going to get some stuff for chocolate chips because comfort food is going to be necessary. And so I've made a pit stop at the grocery store and then I'm going to go get my nails done and I'm going to go full out. Like I'm not, I'm going to get a manicure. I'm going to get a pedicure and I'm probably going to get my eyebrows waxed just because like I just need to eat up as much time as possible. And that seems like a good distraction. So that is what I will be doing. And then we need to finish decor and that is literally it. Like it is, it's crazy how fast it's coming. Um, and then up New Heights, 
I need to watch New Heights. New Heights will be a good distraction, but let distraction o'clock begin because it's time to go in the grocery store. I literally think I got the last set of like white roses that's not in a huge bundle. That's a sleigh. All right, time to go home. Hello you guys, so I decided to come home for a minute because I decided I wanted to eat a little something so I just did a bowl of cereal um, because I feel like I'm going to be at the nail salon for a bit so I just wanted to eat a little something so I'm not sitting there, um, you know, kind of like stirring because I'm hungry. Um, <clears throat> and I also want to change because I have on jeans right now but I want to put on something comfier for the um, nail salon so... I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna change, and they also just changed the lyric at the uh, Spotify pop-up. As she was leaving, it felt like breathing. I'm, I'm just not ready for this album. Like, there's just no way that I'm ready for this album. Like, no, no freaking way. Like, n absolutely no way. Guys, all right, I'm gonna find a Taylor shirt to wear, and then I'm gonna go. We're gonna, we're gonna go. <laughs> the lace tablecloth is on. I just feel like, I feel like the tolerated piano um, from the Eras tour <laughs> should be playing right now. But like, ah! By the way, that was such a jump. I got my nails done. They're like this gray color and I'm obsessed with them. I think they look really good and then I just did like a kind of like clear like I think it was called like seashell or something like that on my toes but it felt really good to get that done and it killed time so it is 7:45. so actually <laughs> nice moving along and now I'm gonna lay the table guys the quills let me just let me just set the table there's just simply no better feeling than like looking around and everything's in its place like I'm gonna be honest for a couple days now, it's looked like sheer chaos in here just because I've been bringing so much um, in and, you know, it's just looked like chaos. So tonight, I was very happy to clean. Um, so now, uh, it's time to try and blow up these balloons. Now, I'm kind of scared. I can't lie. Wait, it's like, there's like this. There we go. All right. I don't know if I'm full of enough hot air to blow these up. My dad also, he gave me when I moved into my apartment, his gift to me was, and it's literally my favorite thing, he got me a like basic tool set and he also got me um, a Ryobi like tire pressure for my car, but it can also blow up balloons. So I, Are we getting somewhere? I feel like maybe. Oh. Oh my god. Shut the beep. Oh my god. You know what? I'm just gonna put a piece of tape on here just No I'm not. I don't I don't need to. We'll save this tape for a rainy day. I am so happy with the way that that's turned out. And I think two is like literally perfect because um, I can just put them on my couch. That is literally thanks to my mom. I'm gonna put these on my couch and then I'll show you guys my decor and then I am gonna close out this vlog. And the next time I pick up a camera, it will be the release day vlog. Who's scared? Me. Oh, oh my God, you guys. <gasps> it's so cute, I have one here. Okay, these didn't come out the way I wanted, but that one's supposed to say TTPD. It got a little messy. Um, and this one's supposed to be a black broken heart, but you know, um, we tried. Um, and then I did end up putting the lavender here. Sorry if you can hear my laundry. And then I have this gorgeous hanging banner that my mom and I also did of all the songs. I literally think it's perfect. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Like, and it goes all the way up. And then you have my table, which I think is my favorite part. And I just have the two quills, the 13 and the TS. Oh my God. And then the white roses, the white roses really add it. And the vase was perfect. It looks like antique and vintage. And then this $3.99 from Hobby Lobby, she ate. Along here, along my little bar area, I have this lace. Oh my God. Oh my God. And then I do have a cat toy hanging from here. I'll probably move this, but I found this for, it was like a dollar. Um, and she would much rather have this than the million of little stuffed mice with catnip that I buy her. Um, I, find, I found this at Hobby Lobby and it's so tortured poet's core. I love it. I cannot believe I am about to close out this vlog because when I close out this vlog, when I shut off the camera, it will be the last time that I talk to you guys like on my camera before we have the tortured poets in our life. And I know to some people this might be extra. However, this is my favorite time in life. Like getting a Taylor Swift album, a brand new Taylor Swift album and getting to experience, I have a cat hair on my nose. Um, getting to experience those new memories, getting to experience a new era. I have loved Taylor since I was eight years old and I remember the first time that I heard Love Story and I couldn't get enough. And years later, I am still that Taylor Swift girl and I will always go above and beyond for her because she has always gone above and beyond for me. And I mean that so wholeheartedly, she's provided me with so much celebration in my life. She's provided me with strength. She's provided me with the soundtracks to my life. She's provided me with my best friend, my best friends in the entire world. And little me, little elementary school me is like so, this is for her. This is for her because I never thought I would have somebody who would be driving like four hours to like come hang out with me and listen to a brand new Taylor Swift album with me. Like I never thought I'd have somebody who genuinely wanted to be my best friend as much as I wanted to be their best friend. So this is gonna be really, really special for me. Um, nobody gets it. <laughs> like Emma, like, you know, there's such like, Listening to a Taylor Swift album with another Swifty is just like the best feeling and I think that's why I just love talking to you guys so much too because I seriously like I love just sitting down and recapping and debriefing with you guys because um, That is what I always wanted when like I was starting to love Taylor and like I would try and you know search videos and like things talking about her and in interviews. So like if I can be that for somebody and you can feel that connection with me because of Taylor, like in the sense of community is the best feeling in the world. And I am so excited and so thankful for every single one of you that are here seriously and like letting me just like ramble and talk about her. And somehow like you guys have found, you know, that in me that sense of community and it just means so much and i love freaking documenting my life for you guys so thank you guys so much i can't say it enough for um being here and i man i'm telling you i don't even know how long that tortured poets department release day vlog is going to be because i'm probably going to start vlogging tomorrow when emma gets here because like we're just going to be <laughs> like trying to distract ourselves and i just feel like I feel like it's gonna be a very long vlog. So get ready, be patient with me because Emma is going to be here the whole weekend and of course I wanna spend time with her. So I will get that vlog up as soon as possible. Trust me because I will be so excited to edit it. But I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video entertained you in some way and um, when you guys are seeing this, we're like, Oh, I'm literally, I didn't, guys, okay, so I usually upload with the exception of like if I finish a video early, I'll post it like in the evening, but my regular time to post is 11 a.m., and that will be 13 hours before the Tortured Poets Department comes out. So if you were here, when I upload it, 
I will be uploading this video 13 hours, T minus 13 hours until the torture post department. That was not even on purpose. Like when I said that, I was like, and when you guys are watching this, it'll be less than 24 hours. I'm like, wait, it'll be 13. On that happy note, I love you guys so much. I hope this video entertained you in some way and I will see you in the next era. Well, we're already here. We're already here, we're already celebrating her, but officially diving in. Oh my God. I love you guys. Bye.